This assembly of a Pilot Custom 74 is fairly simple, although not as straightforward as with some pins. Unscrew the cap, then unscrew the barrel. Post the cap for easy storage. Now, you remain with the section and the converter. It comes with one of those interesting push type converters. If you want an easy way to clean it, because that little metal bit is in the way there, uh, it makes it a little hard to clean. Just grab hold of the reservoir, don't squeeze too hard, grab the metal bit, and give it a firm twist. You should be able to carefully take out the piston unit. Now, you can take off the metal bit. I would not venture into disassembling this. You can easily roll up a tissue and put out the ink a little bit there so you don't have any issues with it. I wouldn't start pulling on things because you don't want to damage this. Then, uh, once all of that is clean, a little bit of silicon grease on the white bit, roll up your tissue, put it in the converter to easily clean the ink reservoir, then put it back in and just screw the metal bit back in place. Should be fairly straightforward. Now, when it comes to the section, this can be disassembled as well. But the thing is, usually you turn left to make something, uh, to loosen something up. The problem here is nib and feed are friction fit. However, simple trick, put the converter in, turn it. And as you can see, the nib unit is coming out. Now, give it a firm twist, take the converter out, and then just remove the entire nib unit. Here you got the nib collar, carefully put it off, be out, be careful, you don't snap off the plastic part that holds the converter in place. Take the nib and feet, rinse them well, clean them well. Once you are done, you will notice the nib slides into place onto the feed, Put it into the nib collar any way you like. There's no specific way to do it. Screw it back in to the section. Now you don't screw the section to the right. You screw it actually to the left here. Now interestingly enough, you can see there are threads on the inside of the section. Probably to remove that metal part. But I have been unable to open that up. It's a pity because as you can see, ink gets trapped there. It would be nice to be able to open it up, but I'm afraid that it's glued in place or something and doing it might crack the plastic. So I've decided to live with it. Screw the section back in, the, the nib unit back in place, put the converter in, make sure it's in all the way, take the barrel, screw it in place, cap the pen, sit down and enjoy yourself some haggis.